You know, people have been saying angels are servants. They are our servants. You can command them. Hear me well. I'm here to demystify many things that is not true. <laughs> because you, you have been commanding angels every day and nothing is happening. You have commanded them to do something they are not doing. Is it that they are stubborn or they are disobedient? So you should understand that your command, when you don't know what angels are sent to do in your life, you look. You cannot command an angel to do what is not in alignment with his purpose. Never. When angel Gabriel come to you, tell angel Gabriel to go and kill your house witch. He will not mind you. Because he was never sent to kill your house witch. He, he is an angel sent to carry information. He is an angel of information. And whenever the angel of God is appearing to you, he appears. When you see Gabriel, he is a carrier of information. Oh Mary! Thou art highly favored. You are highly favored. For you shall have a baby in your womb. And that baby shall be of the Holy One. You shall have a baby. And Mary said, I am a virgin. How shall it happen? And the angel of the Lord told Mary, It shall happen by the empowerment of the Holy Ghost. Have you seen the difference? The responsibility of the angel and that of the Holy Spirit. The angel told Mary, You are highly favored. And you will conceive. And the thing you will conceive shall be a Holy One. And then Mary said how will it happen and then he now said I cannot make it happen but when the Holy Ghost arrive when the Holy Ghost arrive it will happen so by the empowerment of the Holy Ghost it shall happen when the Holy Ghost come upon you all of a sudden you will conceive and then the baby will begin to increase so why didn't the gentleman call Gabriel empower Mary to receive the baby. Because that was not his assignment. Gabriel was assigned to tell the angel, sorry, to tell Mary the information. So he only supposed to carry an information to the woman. It was not his responsibility to empower the woman to give birth. No. You carry the information, the empowerment comes from another source. You see that even in heaven, protocols are obeyed. You don't see a man who's supposed to bring an information there contending with the devil. No. The Bible said once upon a time, in the book of Daniel, Daniel prayed a prayer and then God answered Daniel the first day Daniel purposed his heart to pray. The Bible said, but the prayer was what? It was withstood by the prince of Persia for 21 days until Michael released does that mean that Michael is stronger than Gabriel? In which direction? The information Gabriel have, Michael don't have. The strength Michael have, Gabriel don't have. It is based on responsibilities. That is why even in ministry, you must know what you are called to do. If you are doing the wrong thing, you will not succeed and you will not shine. You will not prosper. There are many men of God doing the wrong thing. That is why they are struggling in ministry. And it is like all hell have broken loose against them. No, sir. You are in an area where you are not supposed to excel. The best way to succeed in ministry, the first step is identifying what you are called to do. If you are Gabriel and you are in a war, you will be killed. You will not have any resource at the end of the day. If you are also Michael and you are trying to prophesy, you are looking for revelation from God, you will not get it at the end of the day. So you must understand what am I called to do to be able to excel in that area. Have you seen the oppression of heaven? How come that the prince of Persia withstood Gabriel but immediately Michael arrived? The information was given. The answer was released. Because even in the realm of the spirit, demons know the responsibility of each angel. Why? Because once upon a time, they were brothers before. So when you are commanding a wrong angel to do a right assignment, demons are laughing at you. Some of you don't even know the angel. Father, I command your angels. Which of the angels? That is why the knowledge of angelic oppression is important. When you 